What's happening, y'all? It's your boy eBay with another reaction video. And I'll be reacting to Honest Trailers Shazam. I really like Shazam. That was a really good movie. Not without his flaws, but everyone has flaws, so. Who the fuck cares? But anyway, let's see what. Let's see what the people over at Honest Trailers have to say. And you can. I'll put the link to the original video in the description. So if you want to see that video in the full screen, you can go over there or you can type in Honest Trailers. I'm sure it'll come up. It was one of the first things that came up when I typed it in. So, <laughs> anyway, without further ado, here we go. Presented by The Boys, taking the fight to the superheroes boys. on Amazon Prime Video on July 26th. July 26th. From the studio that's gone from doom and gloom to fins and grins comes a fun-filled ride for the kid inside everyone. Just maybe not actual kids. Yeah, they have some dark shit in this movie. Kill the little girl. Shazam! Meet Billy Batson. He's got the street smarts of Bart Simpson and the street wear of Tyrone Biggums. I said the same when thing Billy when I watched this into a cave by an old man who claims to be a wizard, which to be clear, kids, is never a good idea. Lay your hands on my staff. He'll become one of DC's <laughs> classic characters, Captain, Captain Marvel. Marvel. No, he used to be Captain Marvel, but DC changed it to Shazam. That's Kazam. Common mistake. I mean the guy obsessed with being worthy and lightning. No, the street rat who gets wish fulfillment powers. Wish fulfillment powers. Being worthy. To be exact. <sighs> okay. It's the one where Chuck flosses. <laughs> Gather round for a heartwarming tale that out families fast and the furious. I'm a big believer in finding family. <laughs> no, me time. Could also be construed as pushing away his family. If a superhero can't save his family, he's not much of a hero. Thank you for this family. You don't think about that. We're in a change of pace from Marvel's Daddy <laughs> Daddy Issues. We get another installment of DC's Sad oh, Mom Parade. Just Give me the bitch. If you choose to leave, you may never return. I'm sorry I never told you. I felt ashamed. <laughs> that your father me. raped me and, well, he tried to rape me. That was, that was so fucked up. As Billy learns that family oh, isn't about who abandoned up. you at a carnival on a whim. It's about the people you're forced to live with, who love you because you're constantly saving their asses from being killed. But Shazam will have to fight more than just the overburdened foster care system. He's up against Dr. Sivana, a veteran character actor out for revenge on DC for casting him as Sinestro <laughs> in Green Lantern. Watch him unleash Almost the power of the Sinestro. seven deadly sins. I thought he was a good Sinestro. Of a different human failing with unique powers that actually, no, never mind. They're all just kind of gray blobs who just eat people. Man, the rock cannot get here yeah, fast enough. Does the next one really have to be about the very angry caterpillar? Apparently, the rock's not even gonna be in the next. He's gonna be in the third one. Follow-up question: What? Hey, it's in the comic books. As DC finally cracks the code on making a hardwarming, fun, inspiring movie about an invincible strong man, a Superman, if you will, that gives kids everything they dream of. No, not turning into a 38-year-old in a styrofoam muscle suit. No, not terrorizing the bullies who make your life a living hell. I'm talking about a kid's ultimate power fantasy. Developing a moderate YouTube following. Doing it for the memes, baby! Smash that like button! Shazam! Starring, you're a wizard, Billy. The movie trying to write the starring section for us. Thundercrack! Captain Sparkle Fingers. Power Boy! Maximum. Getting voltage, is it? Mr. Philadelphia! Human Power Storm. Frequency Flinger. Sir Zapsalot. Yeah, not so easy, is it, kid? Chief of Staff. See? Now that's how it's done. He is a villain. He came here to steal an eyeball from a wizard. Bird Ward of the state. Free Teen Titans Go. An uncomfortable <laughs> amount of R. Kelly references. Believe that you can fly. I believe I can fly. I believe I can fly. R. Kelly? I, I kind of just thought they were more like Peter Pan. Make a live action gargoyles movie, you cowards. Can we be done with flossing now, please? Hey. No. Through the window, through the wall. <laughs> Oh, yeah, a lot of people need to.
It's always Sparky in Philadelphia. <laughs> okay, this is the second DC film with an Annabelle cameo. So The Conjuring definitely takes place in this oh, yeah, universe. I noticed but that teasing movie. us with the cameos already, and then Aquaman hmm. punched him in the face. This episode was brought to you by The Boys, a new Aquaman. series on Amazon hmm. Prime Video. I don't remember if I on saw July 26th. Your friendly neighborhood night monkey. No more Mr. Knife Guy. The week is long. The silver cat feeds when blue is not Wasn't it in, in the wow, West? Wow, West? What? The fuck are you talking about? The fuck are you on about? Uh, I love. I, I, I ain't not gonna say I love. I really like Shazam. Especially knowing the character. I was like, I, I was. I was a little bit disappointed in the the seven deadly sins, but I mean. At the same time, it wasn't really that big a deal to me. Because I was like, eh, they don't. They, they didn't look all that great to me in the comic book either, so. <laughs> I'm like, these were just on screen, and he fought. You know, beggars can't be choosers. But <laughs> anyway, uh, this feels really good, really good. Uh, the is very, very. I knew they were going to do that. <laughs> the doom and gloom. And sparkle or like whatever uh, reference, because DC seems to be doing a lot better now with their more trying to be a little bit more lighter toned, with mature aspect in it, or I guess more mature but with lighter tone aspect in it. But I mean, Shazam, that makes sense. For like even though they do, whenever they finally do a Flash movie, that makes sense. Like, like more so a dark tone, but. The character is very like that. His uh, that's because this because Barry Allen, well, they kind of changed, but more it was more Wally West than Barry Allen. But uh, they they since they've changed it really now. But like, obviously, their Barry Allen seems to use comedy as uh, like uh, 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 what's the word I'm looking for? Like, not a crutch, but like to to. Uh, Lighten up the moment, or like if he's in danger, like Spider Man, like he uses humor, even though he's being shot at. You know, he's he using humor, even though he's like, Yes, you know, like I can easily dodge bullets. So, if I was invincible, like I would, I probably crack jokes to the Lord. Or if I knew I could dodge every bullet that comes at me, like I probably joke and fuck around too. But, but yeah, this is really good. I really, I really I, I did not remember that Annabelle in Aquaman. I don't remember it because it's, it's been a little bit since I've seen Aquaman. I've seen it a few times, but it's been a little bit since I've seen it. I do not remember if I caught that. I caught the, the one that she's saying. I remember seeing that. And then I was like, Annabelle? And, um, and, and I didn't even realize that after I finished watching it. I was like, oh yeah, it made about the same, same about movie studio. But, um, I really like. I, 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 I was a little disappointed. I know Shazam didn't make as much money as some other movies. I mean, it got, I think, the highest like rating of any DC. I think either that or Wonder Woman. But it, I think at the lowest as far as like box office, <sighs> which is funny, isn't it? <laughs> get the highest rating for critics and audiences. I think. I know we got pretty half audiences too, but it had the lowest, it made the, the least amount. That is so interesting. But anyway, let me know what you thought. Let me know what you all thought of the honest trailer. Trailer of Shazam. Did you like Shazam? Did you not like it? Let me know in the conversation down below why or why not. Remember to like, subscribe, and share. I'll see y'all next time. Peace.